Isaiah 54 verse 10 Though the mountains be shaken and the hills be removed, yet my unfailing love for you will not be shaken, nor my covenant of peace be removed, says the Lord who has compassion on you. Isaiah 63 verse 7 I will tell of the kindnesses of the Lord, the deeds for which he is to be praised, according to all the Lord has done for us. Yes, the many good things he has done for Israel, according to his compassion and many kindnesses. James 5 verse 11 As you know, we count as blessed those who have persevered. You have heard of Job's perseverance and have seen what the Lord finally brought about. The Lord is full of compassion and mercy. Lamentations 3 verse 32 Though he brings grief, he will show compassion, so great is his unfailing love. Psalm 51 verse 1 Have mercy on me, O God, according to your unfailing love. According to your great compassion, blot out my transgressions. Psalm 103 verse 13 As a father has compassion on his children, so the Lord has compassion on those who fear him. Psalm 116 verse 5 The Lord is gracious and righteous, our God is full of compassion. Psalm 119 verse 77 Let your compassion come to me that I may live, for your law is my delight. Psalm 119 verse 156 Your compassion, Lord, is great. Preser preserve my life according to your laws. Psalm 145 verse 9 The Lord is good to all. He has compassion on all he has made. Romans 9 verse 15 For he says to Moses, I will have mercy on whom I have mercy, and I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. 2 Corinthians 1 verse 3 to 4 Praise be to God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of compassion and the God of all comfort, who comforts us in all our troubles, so that we can comfort those in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves receive from God. Philippians 2 verse 1 to 3 Therefore, if you have an encouragement from being united with Christ, if any comfort from His love, if any common sharing in the Spirit, if any tenderness and compassion, then make my joy complete by being like-minded, having the same love, being one in spirit and one in mind. Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit, rather in humility, value others above yourselves.